violent buster is what he likes to call it. Getting too close to the action, so I gotta stay back. Look out, King Violent goes for Hurricane Rana. He didn't have the elevation he needed. Oh, steel toe, he missed the steel toe. Which is a lame finisher anyway. Oh no, here it is. The Coptic Lock. Look at that. He's got, he's got a grounded version of the Atom Lock. He was going to try to break King Violent's arms, but King Violent kicking, getting up, and wait a minute, here comes Psycho, a knee. Psycho can't take it anymore. Bedlam is starting to break loose here. Everybody's going after each other. I've been waiting for this. Not backing away, just so I can get the rest of the action up close. So fucking bad. Look at that. Psycho's the only one up. Went for a handstand, Senton. Look at that, King Violent didn't have his... Oh, the inverted steel toe. Or the steel heel as he likes to call it, the steel heel. And that didn't connect properly. Richard Murray is hurting for certain. And now Psycho is in. This is basically... This is basically a slugfest going on right now. A chop. And an uppercut by Abel. A chop to the back. Abel picks up Finnegan. This match is about to come to a header here. And that's it. Abel's got to be finished with that. So I, Hulk Finnegan and Abel have had a rivalry for some point in time. Look at that. Who is going to get a submission first and who's going to get the pin first? A front face lock by the Psycho. Holding Richard Murray down. You can see all five competitors in this match are in a lot of trouble. Finnegan with his belt, front face lock by Richard Murray. Richard Murray's been grounded for quite some time. Finnegan hit Abel with the belt to the head. It all boils down to Richard Murray and Psycho. To the bleachers they go. This time it's going to be the 300 pound Richard Murray and the 162 pound Psycho going at it. He sat on him. On that, on that second bleacher was it the first bleacher. I cannot really tell from this vantage point. Oh and a chop. Chop block to the knee. King Violent is out of the action right now. But I have to keep this further back so I can get both men. As you see on the right, the Psycho going at it with Richard Murray and Hawk Finnegan going at it with Abel. Both men clothesline each other and the Psycho comes off the bleachers. Richard Murray still on his feet. What are you doing in my match? Still him? Now I can get a little closer up to the bleachers. Oh, to the head. Finnegan already in the match, should have been in his quarter. And now it's the Battle of the Irishmen once again. One guy from Dublin, the other guy from Swords, Ireland. Two drunks going at it right now. Here comes Abel. Abel could possibly finish off Hawk Finnegan. And we know Hawk Finnegan has not been pinned in several months. He's been on an incredible roll as of late. Oh, that's it, Irish car bomb. The Irish car bomb, that could be it. One, two, and Finnegan gets dragged. What are you doing? Uh oh, look at this. He's signaling. He's signaling for King Violent. Look at that. Oh, Richard Murray's the legal man. We know Doc Finnegan loves drop kicks. We know he's been a great champion, but his specialty is drop kicks. Getting a little too close to the action, so I got to stay back a couple of more feet. 
This could be it. Hawk Finnegan finally allowing the tag with King Violent. Oh boy, it's getting darker out here, so it's going to be harder to keep up with this action, folks. And I've just been informed by the president of Sadistic Entertainment that we have only three more minutes until this match goes to a time limit draw. Unfortunately, there is a draw. Oh, that's it! That has to be it for King Violent. One. All right. One. Two. Wait a minute. King Violent. One. Two. Three. It's over. He had his shoulders pinned. It's elimination. All right. And now, Abel, I can't, I think from this vantage point, Abel is actually busted open. Abel is bleeding. You may not be able to see it from this distance, but I can see it. So now it is Abel versus Psycho. Uppercut. King Violent has been eliminated. We only have a couple of minutes left in this match before this match goes to a draw. Look at that. Wait a minute, what is he doing? He's all the way to the cage! Damn, this... And here comes Psycho. King Violent is eliminated. He's not supposed to be here anymore. We need to get security. It's called interference. We need security to get him out of the ring. Get him out of the area. King Violent goes for it again. Yeah, one more minute in this match and this could be all over. One, two, three. And now Richard Murray is the only man standing against Finnegan and Psycho. All right, both men talking right now. I'm trying to keep my trying to keep the match going and trying to keep it out. Trying to keep it away from the action so I can get everything in detail. Finnegan signaling that Psycho should finish him off right now. But look at this, sword breaker. One, two, three, and now it's down to Finnegan and Murray, the two drunks from Ireland. All right, we were. Yeah, go Murray. It, no, no, shut up. I've been drinking. Oh, drop kick. I've been drinking. Both men staying on their feet. Finnegan tries for another drop kick, but this time, Fit, Murray knows better. And now a chop. There's a chop right there for good measure. And Finnegan gets chopped again. Both men. You can see numerous complaints. We know Abel is busted open bad. All right, we've been given about two more minutes by the one, two. We've been given two more minutes by the president of Sadistic Entertainment to get this match finished. Psycho's out, Abel's out, and King Violent is out. And look at that. Richard Murray. See the blood on his face. Front face lock by Hawk Finnegan. There's a front face lock you don't see too often, a wrestling move. Or a wrestling hold, that is. What a nice hip toss. Battle, the battle of the Irish drunks right now. Richard Murray setting him up. Sword breaker! That could be it. One, two, and a kick out. Goodness gracious. You might, might give him another sword breaker real soon. I wouldn't be surprised if Finnegan has the strength to carry. If Finnegan's got the strength to carry out uh, Richard Murray up for the Irish car bomb, it'd be the biggest Irish car bomb in sadistic wrestling history. Look at that. Hawk oh, Finnegan. Attempting to go. 
He goes for that line tamer. No, look at that. The inverted Boston Crab. Oh God. But he elevated himself. And that had to hurt Finnegan's, Finnegan's legs. We all know this match is going on for an awful long time past its normal time limit draw. And here he comes. One, two, and a kick out. President of Sadistic Entertainment will review this match tomorrow to see if it's suitable for being drawn for being aired on the internet. Because this match has taken a little bit too longer than expected. What is Abel doing? He's out. He need, we need security immediately. This guy, I'm getting too close to this action. Wait a minute. This match, this match is supposed to be between the fighting Irish drunks. Wait a minute, here comes Finnegan. He's got him over his shoulder. Finnegan is going to try it once again. He's got him over his shoulder again. Can he get it done? Irish car bomb! Double sword breaker! And now it's back down to the Irish drunks. Finnegan and Murray. The two guys that have hated each other since 1999. Oh, look at that! Oh, wait a minute. Finnegan taps! Finnegan taps! It's over! It's over! Finnegan finally loses! And here's your winner, Richard Murray of Swords Ireland. And that is it. Okay.